morning friends, this is Firearm Pop, and we have another really interesting breakfast for you this morning. Uh, I'll go over some of the ingredients and then we'll get to cooking. Anyway, we're going to do eggs, we're going to do a frittata, now in that frittata is going to be some uh, nice uh, hot sausage, and we're putting some hash browns in there, shredded potatoes, some cheese, and let's see what else we got going in there. We got peppers and onion. Uh, that'll all be mixed up, put in pans, and uh, that should come out real good. But the interesting thing we're going to try this morning is a different twist on, guess what? Bacon. We're going to do what they call millionaire's bacon. Now, what that entails is brown sugar and cayenne pepper. And we're going to mix those up with a little black pepper, dredge the bacon in it, put it in pans, and get that in the oven. Oh yeah, in our eggs go sour cream, and we're going to do some biscuits, extra large biscuits. Hopefully we're going to have 25 hungry men coming this morning, and uh, although it's just starting to snow out, so uh, we may be uh, eating a lot of leftovers. Anyway, stay tuned. We're going to get cooking and uh, hope you join us. Okay, we're gonna, the first part of our millionaire's bacon is going to be the brown sugar mixture. Now in that, we have some cayenne pepper and kind of playing these proportions uh, out by ear here. So, uh, I don't want to kill these guys, but yet want it to be right. So we're going to put in some cayenne pepper and then some ground black pepper. And not quite as much, about half as much of the, the ground pepper as we did the uh, cayenne pepper. And that's mixed in here. We're going to do a little mixing in with the brown sugar. So this is going to be an interesting mix. But we got to get this well incorporated. Okay, for our frittata, we're going to do some peppers and onions. So we're just going to get these chopped up. Uh, I'm not going to bore you with watching me chop. So uh, hang in there and we'll be back soon. Okay, there you see. Our peppers and onions all chopped up, ready to go. We just put those on the side for now. Next, we're going to unpackage our sausage and uh, everybody has a different way of doing it, but sometimes there's nothing like just cutting it up and getting it unwrapped, so to speak. Okay, now that we have all our sausage uncased, we're going to uh, get it cooking. So, we'll be back with that. Okay, here we go. Uh, we're taking that bacon, we're dredging it in the uh, brown sugar, cayenne pepper, and black pepper mixture, and panning it up. Now, the big uh, suggestion here is always to use either a disposable pan or uh, line your pan with aluminum foil because once this brown sugar melts on it, you're not getting it up. Okay, <laughs> we'll come back later. Okay, now that that's uh, half cooked, we're going to add our peppers and onions. Okay, we're going to add some salt and pepper. And let that sweat down for a while. We'll be back. Okay, we've cooked this now until the onions have become translucent. 
The peppers are probably still a little crunchy, but don't forget, this is going to cook again in the oven. Okay, so let's uh, end this here and set it on the side. Okay. Into the eggs with the sour cream. And then we're just going to start cracking eggs in there. One of the other tips I've heard is always crack your eggs on a flat surface. You don't get any shells in there. Get out! Okay, we have our, our eggs all done, a little salt, pepper, and the uh, sour cream. So we're just going to get those blended. Okay, we're going to start putting our frittata together. So we have the uh, hash brown potatoes. We're going to put that on the bottom. On top of that, we got our sausage. Okay, then we have our egg mixture. That's 50-50. Okay, on that we got some grated Parmesan and Romano cheeses. And we're just going to, that's going to give it a little zing. There too, cheddar cheese. Okay. Those babies are ready to go in the oven. The bacon's ready to go in. Okay, the biscuits are all panned and ready to go in the oven. But we, we have, don't have any oven space because all the bacon and eggs are in there. So we we'll just have to wait on. Okay, our bacon is out of the oven. I, I don't know if that's done enough. It is way too hot. To even think about touching but uh, it looks absolutely phenomenal and uh, we'll see how that goes we'll be back with the verdict I just wish I could give you a taste test to this it is absolutely phenomenal you get a sweet taste and then about 10 seconds later you uh, want to run for a fire extinguisher which is absolutely great I love it I don't know if everybody's going to like it, but I like it. So, that's our millionaire's bacon. Okay, we got the grits, a gritting. Does a grit grit? I don't know, but it's doing it here. You see it bubbling. Okay, this is almost out of the oven. We're going to uncover it and throw it back in the oven for a little while. Want to do it at 50 cups? Yep. Okay. This is what the uh, egg frittata looks like. It just came out of the oven. Good mark. So we'll put that on the steam table. Mm -hmm.